this year, things are different. Typically on this date, at this time, hundreds of us, students, alumni, faculty members, friends, King's College presidents, past and present, would be together. Together we would be celebrating the McGowan School of Business Forum and it's bringing together students with alumni and friends through the life-changing gift of mentorship. We would be celebrating the newest recipient of the Reverend James Lackenmeyer Award for Achievement in Leadership, the seventh such presentation. And together as a community, we would be learning the stories of students whose lives were changed through the Presidential Hope Fund. But things are different. We don't have the in-person mentorship sessions or the presentation of the 7th Lackenmeyer Award. We won't have the big party in the first class venue. But that's okay. Because here's what we are doing. In this time of crisis, when too many of our students and their families are suffering, we are focusing our energy on making the greatest impact we can on our students who need us most. Led by our past six Lackenmeyer Award honorees, led by the award's namesake, Father James Lackenmeyer, led by the generosity of the King's College Board of Directors, and led by our president, Father Jack Ryan. We've doubled down on our efforts to make available the resources to help our students continue and complete their education at King's. Especially now, in the midst of a pandemic that has disrupted so many lives. Wherever you are, know that we miss you and know that we miss being with you. But we hope that you're healthy, we hope that you're safe, and we hope that you will do all that you can to support our young women and men who need us, who need the Presidential Hope Fund, who need you. The Presidential Hope Fund is a tool that we have here to um, ensure that many of our students can continue on with their education and graduate. When I think of the Presidential Hope Fund, uh, I think it's, a, it's an opportunity to reward uh, our students who work hard and who, who reach an obstacle, a financial obstacle, and they just need that little push. I mean, it's heartbreaking to think that uh, you would have a student that uh, gets to their junior year or senior year and, and is really faced with the question of, can I continue? It's kind of that bridging, bridging mechanism for deserving students where something unexpected happens in their life, whether it's the death of a parent, loss of a job, medical emergency, whatever the case may be. This is an inclusive community and it's a community that really supports the people that are involved in it. And it recognizes that we all need something from each other. Some of them have come back from very bad hardships. Some of them have come back from personal demons and they have survived and thrived. Um, and if you have a student who's a good kid and working hard, performing academically, you'd hate to see them lose the potential of their future. They're going to class every day. Some of them are working two jobs. Some of them are going part-time because it's all they can afford. And the beauty about the Presidential Hope Fund is that it's just giving them a little bit of extra help to get them through those four years. Yeah, it's really touching to hear the stories of uh, the young men and women who have been recipients and how that it has changed their lives and, and in many cases enabled them to complete college. Any student that wants to stay on the campus that's a good student, is dedicated to finishing their education here and seeks our support, deserves that support. We live in uncertain times. There is much we cannot control, yet there remains much we can do. Important actions that make each of us and the communities we live in better places. For our students, that can mean attending to their studies, focusing on their learning, growing, 
and improving, becoming better and more productive citizens so that they may help build a better and more productive world. For our alumni and friends, that can mean appreciating what is going right in our lives, family, friends, and the opportunities to use your gifts and talents to support others and further along a better world. So COVID has made a drastic impact on my um, experience as a student. I lost my job for a few weeks and I was taking summer classes. So I was a little worried about being able to afford my classes and pay for them. And the Hope Fund stepped in and helped me handle my college expenses and really helped take the stress of trying to figure out how I was going to pay for school off my shoulders. So my experience with the Presidential Hope Fund, uh, I've now actually been a recipient twice and it's it's been life-saving so to speak right and especially with everything that went on this past year and it was a real struggle for me come March April you know I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to pay tuition in full and you know thankfully I'm able to come back and, and enjoy my senior year here as well. As you know the Holy Cross Priests and Brothers sponsor King's College. Our motto is in Latin Ave Crux Spes Unica which means the cross is our only hope. The cross is the suffering in life. The cross is the pain in life. The cross is something where you, you think you're at a, at, a, at a dead end. That's precisely where you find hope. And so to call this the Hope Scholarship is, is perfect for the Congregation of Holy Cross because that's what we believe. We believe that when you get to the point where you have deep, deep struggle and you're not sure you can do it, you're not sure you can overcome it, that's where hope enters your life. In these difficult days, know that I pray for you. In these difficult days, I give thanks for you. These are tough days, but we at King's are a resilient bunch. We've been through tough times before, and we'll work through this together by grinding day by day, by staying optimistic, by looking towards the future, we know that better days are ahead. I really reflect about the King's family. Um, it's much more than just an education. There's, there's a connectivity that has stayed with me for the last 34 years. You know, I'm always like to root for the underdogs, but the underdogs who really are trying and really trying to make an impact. And, you know, you want to help them. You want to help them get there. There's nothing more important than mentorship, I think, in life. And I think the Hope Fund is a form of mentorship. We have mentors at our forum who were mentored as students here at King's. They are delighted and honored to come back to give that experience to the students that they had so that they can help them grow as people and become ethical citizens of the world. You know, we always say pay it forward. This is your opportunity to do that as well. It's always a thrill for me to come back to King's. It's a homecoming, really. Uh, and as I wandered around the club a little earlier this afternoon and looked in on the, uh, on the groupings of ment mentors and, and students, I remembered so well the, the, the many ways in which our alumni give back to King's and the incredible resource they and their friends are to King's students. King's provides that ability to leave this institution, go out into the world, armed not only with expertise in whatever field they've studied, but also a sense of really important values. That's why there needs to be a, a hope fund coming from the top to make sure that every student that's interested, every student that's potentially a better citizen, a more well-rounded citizen of this country, has that opportunity. That's why it's so important. You know, your contribution will go to needy students and worthy students who have suffered setbacks, financial setbacks. And your contribution to this cause will go to them to see that they are able to 
graduate from King's College. I can't think of a better way to spend your money than to help someone graduate from college. Thank you so much to the Presidential Hope Fund donors. It means so much to me and countless other students that you help our studies all along the way. Thank you so much to the donors of the Presidential Hope Fund. You have made a great impact on my life and the life of others on campus. Your generosity is greatly appreciated. Father Jack Ryan has done so much as the president of our beloved King's College. Exciting new in-demand programs in academics and athletics. New facilities for living and learning, collaborating and competing. Partnerships with some of the best schools in the country, like our sister school, the University of Notre Dame. Improving the neighborhood of our fair city. Leading fiscal stability that has generated impressive endowment growth in years of budget surpluses, and so much more. But among Father Jack's most important achievements to him is the Presidential Hope Fund. Identifying our students who are working hard, doing their part, but who need a little more help to get through the semester, get through the year, get through graduation. Tuition, room, board, books, technology, meeting the foundational needs of our students so they can continue, so they can complete. Father Jack's leadership on the Presidential Hope Fund is so very King's. Personalized attention, caring community, bringing access and opportunity to those who need it, bringing hope to those who deserve it. As you may know, I will retire as president of King's in June 2021. The McGowan School of Business Forum, which began when I was Dean of the McGowan School of Business, and the Lackameyer Award, which began when I was president, are both very meaningful to me. More importantly, they are so meaningful for our students. This is my last Lackameyer Award and MSB Forum as president. Of course, I would prefer to celebrate with you in person, but here we are. And here you are, again stepping forward to support our students in need. In these last many years, as part of this celebration, you have been so generous to our school, to our students, and to me. Through the power of mentorship and through the power of hope, you have done so much for our students. In these very difficult days, when our students need us, thank you for supporting the Presidential Hope Fund. You are a hope bearer.